Hey everyone, do you know of you? Today, let's unbox this, baby. Cringe. Hi everyone, T with another view. Today, and in today's video, we are going to be reviewing the ViewSonic VP2468A monitor. It's a 24 inch display, IPS panel, 9020 by 1080 resolution, and I have to say, I'm in love. So, this monitor, for like our side of things, the image side of things, um, it has 16.7 million colors, it's full HD. Out of the 24 inch display, 23.8% nope, 23.8 inches are viewable areas. And the panel itself has antique layer, but for me it's awesome because I have a window right like behind me. So that really helped me a lot. And uh, for you gamers, I don't, this is not the most optimal for gamers, but the response time is five milliseconds on the refresh if i'm not mistaken so uh okay what does it have and how does it work that stand you're seeing right now look at that baby that's the most sturdy thing i have felt in a long time i'm obsessed with the fact that i can rotate it and work with it both horizontal and vertically i am obsessed with the design is sleek and simple and the only thing i see is one cable going down oh my god oh i'm, I'm i i love it i i absolutely love it um oh and by the way i completely forgot this this monitor is pantone approved so you know if, if you don't believe me, believe Pantone, I think. <laughs> that's that's the way to go. But let's talk sketches for the artwork I did for them. And then we can talk prices and the rest of the specs for this piece. Not this piece, this spotter. What, what am I saying? Okay, let's talk sketches. For this piece, I was thinking about my artwork with the whale and the iceberg like from my eco invasion series and I wanted to do something on the same vibe of that because I think that gives a really good focal, focal point for the main subject on this case being the monitor itself. So I created a little iceberg, I just wanted it to be as simple as I could but since it's it was like June and this was going to be posted during pride month I wanted to add a lot of a lot of color and like try to make the iceberg um kind of a prism 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 is it I don't know how to say that like basically a reflector of light into a rainbow just to both respect the brand and give you a little bit of pride because it's June so you know I had to do it um I think the final sketch it's really good for what it is like it, it, it fits all of the purposes and this in a way is kind of a brief me uh episode because I had a brief and I made it to my style and I really, really was impressed with the end product. You're going to see me work on it in a second. But yeah, like I made the iceberg be the main focus point. And then I just have like elements around it that give you like the environment and magic. And then a lot of color because that's my thing. But yeah, so now with the sketched almost done, let's talk specs for the rest of the monitor. So this monitor has... A lot of connection like a lot of options in connection <laughs> it has two usb type a one usb type b and one usb type c it also has an ethernet lan connector a port not connector port um hdmi 1.1 in and a display port both in and out like i this is this is really 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 sad so i had i have my computer for the past what six months six years and i <laughs> i tried to plug my hdmi from my old monitor into my graphics card and it like it worked but then like there were these other ports and i didn't know what they were 
and I just found out they were display ports. I didn't know that was a thing, so I, I really messed up there. But yeah, now I know because um, this 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 monitor came with a display port cable. So I learned something, I guess. Um, okay, in usage and how I felt about the whole experience. So I decided for the like benefit of the review itself to not um, change the default like of the color light all of those things for the main bulk of my usage so I could see like how it came from factory it also comes with the calibration you saw it at the beginning uh, from factory so you can see like all of the specs of the calibration but I have to say as someone that mainly works uh, with pieces that don't need perfect color of course this was either like even with that in mind this was the most color corrected like most calibrated screen i've ever looked at like it's i've printed work for other things during the time i've been using this monitor and it's it's just just perfect i don't know like i think the white is a bit off but that's the only thing I saw like from factory. It also has a bunch of presets for like photography and like all of these other um, pre default standard, whatever um, usage. So I think you are gonna be able to find anything you need with the monitor. Now for the things that this monitor in my opinion has that other like budget monitors wouldn't have it's the tilt function so it tilts forward six degrees and backward 21 degrees so that for me it's really a good um add-on because sometimes like i'm lower or higher or i'm like standing that so that it's just good for comfort and then it rotates 60 degrees like the whole arm of the monitor rotates 60 degrees from one side to the other so that's that's also really good for my workflow because a lot of the times i have like i push my tablet forward so i need the monitor to to rotate to the side so i can see it better so yeah um the only thing for me that's like a con unfortunately is the 1080p resolution because nowadays with like all of the needs we have 4k is kind of the minimum standard for like most video work but for what i personally do i don't see a difference i tr i tricked my graphics card into making it 4k i also did the same with my tablet and they both work fine i don't see any like drop in resolution so overall i would say i'm one impressed this is probably the best monitor i've used so far two it's a very budget friendly three i'm happy that the like the business behind it supports pride and they supported me trying to do something related to pride like i'm always happy when i i can support a business that supports my community so with all that said this is my review my opinion i'm happy with the monitor but go make your extra research if you felt that i didn't touch on something you wanted to know and from there make your choices because money is very important don't just waste it <laughs> but yeah thank you so much if you like the artwork leave a drop leave a drop don't leave a drop <laughs> leave a like on the video and i will see you on the next one. Oh, by the way tell me if you saw my photoshop feature there's a whole video coming talking about that so stay tuned okay see you in the next video bye